Arc Browser is the shiny new kid on the block and if been using the browser, you know that the customization options are to die for. My name is Yadullah, you're watching Candido Technology and in this video we are talking about how you can customize your own themes in Arc. Changing theme on your Arc Browser is a very simple process, uh, regardless of whether you're using it on Windows or Mac OS, you just go ahead and hover over your space name, you will see a small edit button here, when you click on it, you will have the edit theme color option. Once you click it, this theme selector or color selector will pop up and now you have several options to play from here. You can select between dark and light modes. You can select some predefined colors right here or then you can control their luminosity. So basically how effective the color is. If I go with yellow, I can change that region as well. So yeah, if you're on a Mac OS, you will also see a graininess dial here and you will get color options to create gradients, which means you can add more color options, but these options are not available on Windows at the moment. Another setting that is specific to Windows, if you click on the arc button at the top and then go all the way down to settings, you will see under appearance a Windows backdrop option. What this does is it allows you to choose from Acrylic and Mika. Now, Mika is the default backdrop option, but what it does is that it doesn't let the transparency of the background come in as well. So whatever your wallpaper is, Mika lets that show, but any windows that are under Arc will not show up. This is uh, a beneficial feature if you want to save on system resources as Acrylic tends to use more system resources as it renders everything that's under Arc through the viewport. Uh, now, if you switch to acrylic, and let me just close this, go back. As you can see, you can see the desktop behind uh, in a much better fashion. In fact, if I take this setup, go back in, and then you can see, you can completely see through everything that's under Arc at the moment, including uh, any minimized windows and of the sort. But if I go ahead and swap it out with Mika, which is the default option, come back here, you can see that this is now opaque and doesn't show through anything. So depending on your system settings and your preferences, you can choose between Mika and Acrylic. And that's how you change your theme in Arc on Windows. If you like these videos, consider subscribing, give us a thumbs up, press the bell icon and tell us in the comments below if we can make any more such content for you or if you have any thoughts on this video and I'll be there down talking to you. If you want to know more about tech, visit our website, candid.technology, follow us on social media, follow me on Instagram or Twitter and we'll see you in the next video.